In today's episode, you will learn how to monitor the efficiency of a 12 volt battery using Arduino 0 to 25 volt voltage sensor, HC-05 Bluetooth module, RTC DS3231 real time clock, and an Android cell phone. The battery voltage information is stored in the Arduino at regular intervals, which can be defined in the programming. Then using the Android cell phone, the stored information can be requested wirelessly by sending a command to the Arduino. The received information is stored in the cell phone database along with the date and time information. The information stored in the database can be used for the post analysis. This project is entirely based on my previous tutorial based on the wireless battery voltage monitoring system. In this project, I used the same 0 to 25 volt voltage sensor and the same HC-05 Bluetooth module. In this project, I didn't use any database and as you can see, there is no date and time information. For the best understanding, watch this tutorial and then you can resume from here. In today's episode, we will cover number 1. RTC DS3231 real time clock pinout. Number 2. 0 to 25 volt voltage sensor pinout. Number 3. HC-05 Bluetooth module pinout. Number 4. Complete circuit diagram explanation. Number 5. Program explanation and finally number 6 testing. Without any further delay, let's get started. The components and tools used in this project can be purchased from Amazon. The components purchase links are given in the description. The RTC DS3231 is a low cost, highly accurate real time clock which can maintain hours, minutes and seconds. This module can also maintain the day, month and year information. The RTC DS3231 module also has automatic compensation for leap years and for months with fewer than 31 days. This module can be powered up using 3.3 volts or 5 volts. As you can see clearly the DS3231 module has total of 6 male headers and are clearly labeled. Out of these 6 pins we will be using only 4 pins which are the SCL, SDA, VCC and ground. For the extreme basics, watch my video tutorial on the RTC DS3231 in which I display the date and time information on the 16 into 2 LCD. I will provide a link in the description. This is 0 to 25 volt voltage sensor, which I will use for measuring the battery voltage. This module is capable of measuring the voltages ranging from 0.0, .0 to 445 volt to 25 volts DC. As you can see on one side we have a block terminal. This is where we connect the voltage and ground wires coming from battery. The voltage wire is connected with a VCC terminal and the ground is connected with the ground terminal. On the other side we have three male headers labeled as plus, S and minus. The S pin of the sensor module is connected with the analog pin of the Arduino Omega and the minus pin is connected with ground of the Arduino while the plus pin is not connected. If you want to learn how to modify the sensor to measure higher voltages greater than 200 volts then watch my tutorial. The link is given in the description. This is the HC-05 Bluetooth module. As you can see, I have already connected some jumper wires so that it can be easily interfaced with the Arduino. It has a total of 6 male headers clearly labeled with State, RXD, TXD, Ground, VCC and EN. Out of these 6 pins, we will be using only RXD, TXD, Ground and VCC. For the extreme basics like for example changing the name of the Bluetooth module, pairing code and how to use the AD commands watch my video tutorial. The link is given in the description. 
Now let's have a look at the complete circuit diagram. This is the complete circuit diagram of the 12 volt battery efficiency monitoring system. As you can see on the left side, the voltage sensor VCC is connected with a battery 12 volt input and the ground of the voltage sensor is connected with the ground of battery. The S pin of the voltage sensor is connected with the analog pin A1 of the Arduino and the minus pin is connected with the Arduino's ground while the plus pin is not connected. The HC-05 or HC-06 Bluetooth module VCC pin is connected with the Arduino's 5 volt. Ground pin of the Bluetooth module is connected with ground of the Arduino. The RXD pin of the module is connected with pin number 2 of the Arduino and RXD pin of the Bluetooth module is connected with pin number 3 of the Arduino. The Bluetooth module communicates with the Arduino through serial communication. As you know, in Arduino, we have only one serial port available on pin number 0 and pin number 1. We will use the Arduino's default serial port for the debugging purposes and make another serial port using pin number 2 and pin number 3. The RTC DS3231 module ground pin is connected with the Arduino's ground. The VCC pin is connected with the Arduino's 5 volt. The SDA pin is connected with the Arduino's analog pin A4, while the SCL pin is connected with the Arduino's analog pin A5. This program is the combination of all the three programs used in my previous three tutorials. You can find links in the description. The circuit diagram and programming can be downloaded from my website. I have already uploaded this program. Let's watch this project in action.
support me on Patreon for more videos. I hope you like today's episode. Like and share this video with your friends. See you in next episode and thanks for watching.